think I figured out an issue with OBS and Twitch Studio Beta. They demand access to your microphone. You can see here I've selected my USB sound card. And it had an error message up here demanding access to my microphone, which it doesn't need for me to use my external sound card. So I went here to see if I could unallow Twitch from my microphone because I don't want it to have access to my damn microphone. So let's watch ha what happens when I unclick this. Uh, quit and reopen. Okay. Save and quit. See what happens. Twitch Studio opens back up. Now, even here, there's my audio. And look at that. There's the damn resolve audio error. This is bullshit. So let's click on audio box USBs, resolve audio error, which brings up settings, just the same as that little settings button below it. Grant permission to use your microphone. Studio needs access to your computer's microphone so it can listen to you. That doesn't make sense. I don't want that. I want my external sound cards or a microphone that I plug in through a sound card, but I absolutely do not want anything to do with my computer accessing microphones in programs. So, audio is still going into the background. Oh. Grant permission. Uh, it didn't have to quit and reopen last time. This is ridiculous. And there you go. There's your audio. All this time, I've had problems in OBS. So this is just my control room. I can kill it and the master main volume still comes out of the mixer into my USB sound card and I have volume. And here I'm getting more dynamic volume than I was with uh, Streamlabs, which is using the slider as a limiter, and the levels were way blown out, and so all of my audio was squashed. You see, this is a true level killer, not a limiter. And so I'm getting some dynamics in here in Twitch Studio. I like that a lot better. So Stream Elements, or Streamlabs wants to charge you anyway for all of their crap with an absurd amount of money, in my humble opinion, as a new streamer. Um, and then if you notice, their audio um, is just flatlined, and this slider is a limiter. So uh, Twitch Studio doesn't really do all the things I want it to, so far as I've seen. Um, it doesn't engage with some of your other overlays, and maybe I can set those up, but let's just uh, back out of here and check out a couple of the other programs. So, screw your Twitch Studio. I'll take your microphone access away. Here's OBS, your open broadcasting. Hey, there's my beautiful dome. Uh, failed to authenticate, I'll work with that later. Now you have to do the authentication once you make affiliate. Um, now this is funny. You can't click, and this is, I just updated it. So the old version, <laughs> you see I'm clicking. But the damn window doesn't go away. You can't check automatically for updates. So that window stays there for freaking ever. Um, and you just have to click there. So let's go um, back to settings. Well, well, we'll just look here. I've got it going through my, we we'll call it Mackie blanking mixer. Overlay on mic, low G. So um, properties, and it's selected for audio box USB. So still got the audio going. That's my control room level. There's nothing there. Uh, it's not giving me an error in this one, but let's see what happens. This is just an experiment here. If I give OBS access to my microphone, quit and reopen, all right, fine. 
<sighs> Fail to communicate. That's fine. I don't care. That's obnoxious still. Click here. Look at that! There's audio. Unfucking believable. Pardon my French. I'm not very happy right now. Um, properties. Audio box USB. So it's not the Mackie mixer. I don't have that one plugged in right now. It's routing synthesizers to my other mixer. Um, so it's got way blown out levels. I'm showing clipping on this PGOS USB mixer. There. Bring down the mains, which are incredibly low. So something's going on with my uh, USB sound card. But you can see there's some kind of dynamics here better than the other program. So, uh, OBS Studio will quit you. So I solved a huge thing right now. To work with any of these, SE Live will also probably have to have access to the microphone um, itself, even though it uses OBS as a an open source backdrop to create its uh, overlay system. Don't check, check. So the same problem here. SE Live has the same glitch, and I've just up. This one didn't have an update, but OBS did. Mm, so, Mackie fucking mixer and settings, props, audio box USB. Okay. Now, did I give it permission yet? We still have audio. See live, quit and reopen. So if you're having audio issues with any of these programs, look, there it is, it's blown out. So it's at least dynamic. You need to allow the microphone. Um, Stream Labs desktop must have demanded that absolutely and uh, wouldn't work without it. So we'll quit this again. I'll show you how much Streamlabs desktop sucks. This is the one you have to pay for, but for some reason it was the only one that worked to get audio through. And uh, so I would do my streaming from here. And then I had to, especially after the authenticator, now it's showing a little more dynamic. Earlier, the symbols were carrying, so this acted like a limiter. And the symbols carried all yellow, and then it would just back down a little bit for the uh, in-between beats. I deleted beats to get that gap in there to show. So, audio box, settings. So I've got an issue with my audio box and it'll show clip at zero sometimes and then not. So now I'm able to turn up my audio box for no good reason. Well, I've got main down. All the things are going wrong with this tonight, but uh, this being the volume control, it's so weird. You can see um, down here, it's clipping at a volume that's just not very high. My mains are below what they should be on the mixer going out, so. Um, earlier it was just all yellow with a quash, a limit, or a shelf, wherever you put the slider. Now it's, for some reason, dynamically showing Kill the control room, make sure we're not using. So it's not affecting the microphone. I'll kill the mains. Microphone check! We also had an issue where audio was appearing here when the mains were all the way down. So for some reason, Streamlabs is behaving a little better right now since I'm videoing. It knows. Uh, but anyway, I hope this helps. If you have issues in any of your programs, Give permission to the damn microphone, and then um, in your audio settings, let's go back in. 
we have uh, Mackie Mixer, Alert Box, Chat Box, Follower. Uh, microphone's not even in the list. So what you can do is add it and then, so we'll drop a source. And there's no direct microphone one, but built-in mics. So these are existing. We'll click add an ex add a extra one. Microphone, mic and Mac. Add the source and then for the device, MacBook Pro microphone. Now we can see that it's there and I can give it a mute so that the program is not allowed to use it. So we've given it permission and now I've told it zero. So they can still probably hear us and listen in on what we're doing and whatnot. But you can see here, it's gone away. There's your mute button. Check, check. Big Brother is watching you. Streamlabs, OBS, and SE Live want to watch you. Freaks, pissing me off tonight. Hope you're pissed too. Pretenuator out.